common mistakes that you see, particularly like younger developers making or inexperienced developers making, you know, somewhat frequently just doesn't resonate and, and you just see over and over again kind of the same thing from a, you know, a mistake standpoint? You know, we do so much with a lot of customers, repeat customers. You know, when someone asks us to look at something real early on, don't get, we, don't get me wrong, we make mistakes too, but we try to do the best of giving that developer a true estimate, like what we think it's going to take to take it from ground zero to being complete. So there's a lot of gaps and holes, especially, especially when it's schematic, right, that you need to fill from past experience, you know, maybe taking a deeper dive. Or whatever, and that when we're when we're competing against some other GCs that don't do that, or you know they don't know the product type, there can be a huge swing in the numbers. At the end of the day, once you get to, to GMP and TSCDs, for the most part, we're using probably ninety percent of the same subs. And it's not like there's a magic sauce when a guy's five million or ten million dollars less at a schematic level, and like, wow, this guy really wants it. You know what I mean? It's it's just not there. Right, it's right, right. it's hocus pocus. You know what I mean? Yeah. 